Good morning, sunshine followers. I just wanted to share with everybody, I came out here today to spray my peach tree with um, a neem oil mixture. If you have fruit trees and vegetable gardens, it's best to spray your um, trees, your garden with uh, neem oil to keep the pest away. And usually on fruit trees, you try to um, spray the tree before you get blooms. But my tree, I pruned it, pruned it back last year. And I wasn't thinking that I was going to get such a big um, outcome of leaves and peaches this year because my tree is a established um, older tree. And uh, let me show it to you. I think you probably have seen it in some of my old videos, but. This is my peach tree. Mm -hmm. It's my peach tree. And as you can see, let me see if I can show you some of my baby peaches that I have already. Look at there. Look at mama's peaches. See there? They're looking good already. Little baby peaches. Okay. Y'all see my earrings that I have on today that my son bought for me? Let me see if I can get a better view of those. See there? Look at there. It says thankful and blessed. Thank you, Marianne, for making your mom look beautiful as ever. But back to the video. Um, yeah, spraying my um my peach trees this morning. Like I said, if you have a um sprayer, gallon sprayer, this is a um, two gallon sprayer that I got from Home Depot and you just fill it up to the fill line with your water and you put your put your neem oil mixture in there which is like I said with for a two gallon it's two tablespoons um, and two gallons of water or one gallon one tablespoon of neem oil and since I have um, blooms and tree already I just take my sprayer and spray, spray along the base of my tree. Just spray the base of it, keep the pest away, keep the ants from crawling up, so on and so forth. They love to get onto your fruit and eat it all up before you can. And I don't know about y'all, but I am not into sharing my peaches with ants and pests and all of that. So this year I am trying to get ahead of the game and just spray the base to uh, stop the problem from starting because I want to enjoy my peaches this year. Last year my peaches just draw up like a raisin and I think the ants and bugs got to them before I could. So getting ahead of the game this time. So just thought that I would share that with y'all this morning on how to keep the pest out of your fruit trees and out of your vegetable gardens. You could just spray them with um, Neem oil. Y'all see my baby over there? He follows me everywhere I go in the garden. That's my bull mastiff, Prince. And Prince is old. And I'm hoping that he's not on his last leg, but according to my veterinarian, um, he's old. And he's um, hanging in there, though. Hanging in there. So, we're going to wish him well and keep him out here in the garden with Mama. That's his favorite place to be as well. So that's it. Um, just wanted to share that with y'all and share my baby peaches. Y'all have a blessed day. Like, comment, comment, like, and subscribe. Get in some subscribers. Y'all help me build my subscriber following. And also comment. Tell me what type of videos you want to see. Tell me what type of content you want to see or hear from. And so on and so forth. And I'll be happy to bring it to you. Um, don't know if I had shared with you all yet that I am going to be um, undergoing a surgery here in the next couple of weeks for my bad knees y'all or my bad knee um, I have put it off as long as I could and at this point um, it just has to be done so it's gonna kill me not being able to get out here in my garden like I want to but um, has to be done has to be done so we're gonna get it done I'm behind on a lot of things. You see my pool over there is trying to turn green from all this pollen. I gotta 
get out here and get that done. I'm supposed to be having some work done in my backyard, which is also why I haven't started a lot of my gardening and my raised beds that I have here in my garden because they're just going to come back behind me and tear it up. So, um, but I got to get some gardening in. So, we're going to have to make some type of compromises here. But that's it. Comment, like, and subscribe. Love talking to y'all. Um, y'all have a blessed day.